Well, this weekend at Bayfront, Oktoberfest has been serving up brats in Polish, but it wouldn't be a real Oktoberfest without a whole bunch of wieners. Today, spectators got to relish in a tradition for the Duluth Oktoberfest, the Dachshund Derby. Northern News Now's Isabella Zadra got to catch up with organizers and dog owners who participated in the race. Oktoberfest is a German tradition where people dance, celebrate German heritage, and most importantly, drink beer. And what goes better with a beer than a wiener? Wiener dogs and their owners gathered at Bayfront Sunday afternoon to compete in the Duluth Oktoberfest's annual Dachshund Derby. The event is the largest Dachshund Derby in running of the wieners uh, in the state of Minnesota. You know. The Derby debuted in 2019 with just 16 dogs. This year it was capped at 64 and even included a wait list. Ryan Kern is the announcer of the Dachshund Derby. He says that even though this isn't a classic German activity, it is a fun opportunity to praise their home breed. And there's nothing truly, there's nothing funnier uh, than watching wiener dogs sprint as fast as they can, get sidetracked, jump outside the course, do circles, um, and then try and fish. Bruno was one of the many dogs to compete today. At the age of 12, Bruno was a late entry and seen as an underdog, even by owners Steve and Pam. But when the other pups in Bruno's heat struggled to find the finish line, he came out as the top dog. Steve and Pam, who reside in Clear Lake, Minnesota, were ecstatic that Bruno won, even if it was by default. We got a participation ribbon already. That's more than we thought we'd get. We're just so proud of him. Yes. Yes. He's going to get a chicken sandwich now. Steve and Pam know that even though Bruno beat his heat, he truly just got lucky. Do you got hope for Bruno in the final round? No. <laughs> we really don't. Kern says the next year they may expand the number of dogs again, continuing to give more dachshunds like Bruno the chance to come out as the big wiener. At the races, Isabella Zadra, Northern News Now. And while Bruno wasn't the big winner, the top prize went to a dachshund named Gracie, who won bragging rights and a custom Duluth October Festival dog collar.